Guys, I'm starting to learn something. As you guys can see from the title, people have to love or hate you. And whatever you do, becoming a polarizing figure is everything. Now, I used to be one of those guys that could walk into a room, I'm like a chameleon. I can make everybody in the room generally like me. Maybe they don't love me, but I'll get along with everybody. But as I've gotten older, as I've acquired more wealth, as I've become more confident, as I've um, gotten better with women, things that kind of have in turn helped me increase my confidence, I realized being Mr. Nice Guy is not it. You don't really get anywhere in the world like that. And anything that you do, whether it's you want to be a YouTuber with your YouTube audience, you want to be a musician with your music audience, both things that I am, uh, you're at your job with your friends, even with family, I feel like people have to genuinely either really love you or really hate you. Just think about it, most of history's most polarizing figures were always like that. If you think about people like past presidents, uh, the Kennedys, even if you think of like kind of bad dark figures like Hitler, really uh, not a good example, but just figures in the past that have gripped people either by their hearts or with their hatred, it was always one or the other. I think just kind of laying down and letting people walk over you, just kind of generally getting along with everybody can feel like the thing that you're supposed to do, but then people don't actually have any type of judgment about you. Like if there's somebody where I'm like, oh yeah, he's an okay guy, whatever, then I'm not really on that person's side, you know? I don't really care about them. It's almost like they're an NPC in my life. But if there's a guy out there that's like a uh, really big like, Andrew T, whatever, so much hate. But he was able to get so much bread, so much recognition. He has this thing like the real world and stuff. The few people that did love him really loved him while the rest of the world hated him. And again, maybe not the best example, but that's usually how it how it's best to be, you know? Now, I'm not saying you should go out there saying brash things, doing terrible things to other people just for the fact that, okay, a couple people will like me, but a lot of people will hate me. No, don't become 6'9", don't become just like a bad guy for the sake of it. But what I'm saying is live your true self. Be who you really are. People either love you, they rock with you, or they hate you. And I'm practicing this in my own life right now, guys. Again, just another quick psychology video. If you guys want to schedule a call with me, my link is down in the description. We can set something up. Comment down below what you think about today's video. Leave a like if you like today's video, and hit the subscribe button. I'll be back very soon. I love you guys.